you wonderful people welcome to another video in this video we're going to look at next week's pre-orders some pretty important news for all you age of sigma fourth edition players and uh, let's jump in Okay, Games Workshop have just literally dropped this article. Sunday's previews, all the extras you may need to play the new edition. So, pretty much guarantee this is going to be everything else that we're going to need. The rule book, General's Handbook and the like. So unfortunately, no Old World Dwarf pre-orders next week. Sad times. So, we've got the rule book. The 288 page hardback rule book is your ultimate companion in the new edition of Age of Sigma. Yes, so all of those people who do not want to order the box can finally get to order our our rule book next week. Good to know. I will be one of those people. We also have a limited edition one which looks a little bit jazzy. I'm going to be completely honest here. Not a fan. This looks a little bit crap. Um, not a fan at all. It, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not digging that artwork. Um, but yeah, okay. Some people will. Um, obviously, I, I don't shop directly from Games Workshop, so I'm not going to get one of these anyway. The General's Handbook, 2024-2025, must it have important. Now, I thought it was going to be cards. That doesn't look like cards. That looks like a proper book. So inside the core, uh, in, you'll find the core and advanced rules as well as the season rules which are themed on powerful bones of your General's Honor Guard. There are also 12 battle plans representing the greatest hits list for previous editions, a rules update for all of the Universal Ender spells, and a tournament organizers pack that provides advice for all of those who want to run events. I honestly thought this was going to be cards. They said it was cards. It's cards in the box. It's not cards in this one. Ah, sad times. I was really hoping for something like Prior Nexus, but we get a book. Um, okay. Shame. But never mind. It is what it is. We'll be pre-ordering anyway because I need it for events. Okay, so next up we have the Fire and Jade um, basically box. So if you want to play if you want to play games of Spearhead, obviously you've not got the Skaven Tide box, but you want to play Spearhead, this is the box you need. It is the Fire and Jade gameplay book pack. You get your board, you get a bit of terrain. You get your cards, and that's it. So everything that you need, you get this. Um, obviously, I would say this, that depending on how much this box is going to cost, as well as the book, which I'm imagining is going to be next, I would add it all up, and if you can get hold of the actual um, Skaven Tide bo box, I would probably imagine it's about £130 retail. I think like once this once you buy this in the books, you're probably going to be pushing on nearly 100 quid. I would probably just splash out the extra and try to get your hands on a Skaven Tide box. I do believe there are still quite a few kicking around the interwebs. So, yeah, it's probably going to be cheaper in the long run to get it, plus you get all of the models. And if you don't want the Stormcast or the Skaven, you could just sell them for about 30, 40 pound and basically brings that box under the price of what this is going to be. But that's just an idea. Then, faction packs. Oh, we have rules. Get all the rules you need for your faction packs in one convenient place. Each faction pack will be available to download for free before the launch of the new edition. Still haven't telling us when. And will be available to purchase as packs as cards. Each pack contains a background summary. So, obviously, if you're going to be wanting to play it, this is the main thing I'll be pre-ordering. Apart from the rule book, obviously Cities of Sigma and Seraphon will be the two sets that I pre-order straight away. Maybe Blades of Corn or something else that might catch my eye. But yes, obviously the card packs super important, super super important. Um, would be really nice if looking at my previous video, um, if they could actually tell us when the faction packs will be coming down to download. At least we know that next week we're going to be able to pre-order the cards. But it, when there's a two-week period. There's actually two weeks before we actually get everything launched on the 13th. So when are we going to get these faction packs? And obviously we're going to get some Grand Alliance dice. Um, Shrinkflation is definitely in play here. We get less dice for more money. 
That's right. That's right, people. Less dice for more money. They used to sell sets of dice for about £22, and you got about 20 dice in the set, but not anymore. Now you get 16 dice, but you still pay more money than you originally did. Shrinkflation in massive amounts. And obviously, White Dwarf, we're going to look at 502, the Skaven Return, Skaven versus Golden Cask, probably going to be a big Age of Sigmar edition of the magazines, so pretty cool. And then Black Library, we get some Night Lords stuff, and then some Daughters of Cain, and then on Warhammer Plus, the Feeling subscription service, we get a little bit of Master Classing and Law Mastering, uh, no Battle Report, because you know, a multi-billion pound corporation can't actually produce a battle report every week um because that would be too hard and uh, no animations i don't think the last time i seen an ad animation advertised was a long long time ago i think they've just give up on it, the animations now and that is it that is it that is everything we're getting on pre-order next week good news age of sigma fans we are getting it one thing missing the jade fire book is only looking like it's going to be available inside that Skaven Tide box. So remember what I said about trying to pay the extra money? I would just go out and try to pay that extra money now and get the Skaven Tide book because you get all of that stuff in that box, a load of models and the book and the rule book and everything else. It's probably going to be worth it a lot better if you are wanting to play Spearhead. Um, yeah, no dwarfs for Old World. Uh, yep, yeah, cool. And uh, no date or anything about faction packs. Hopefully we'll hear something tomorrow about faction packs. But we will see. But that is me, everybody. Thank you very much. And I will see you in the next one. And remember, people, subscribe, like, share, comment, check out members area, Patreons, all of that good stuff. And I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye for now.